Uh, hi, good morning everyone. So I'm here to show you how you can format your external hard drive to be able to use it on Mac and a Windows system at the same time. Because I've been running with that problem for like a long time but now I decided to find you know the way to get my hard drive work on both systems so my problem was I had a, I have an external hard drive for like a 2 gigabyte or 2 terabyte and the first time I bought it I forgot to format it to like to be compatible with those two systems, I mean window and Mac. So for me to do that before you don't have any file saved on it. So you should have to format it to MS those fat, which I didn't do. And I just start you know saving my file on the on my Mac until I get to like 200 gigabytes which is a lot of file so now when I decided to use it on window it doesn't work is always asking me for permission that's why I realized that I have to change it like to change the format of the hard drive to universal so it can be read with Mac or Windows or Linux, any operating system, and this is how I did. So, this is my hard drive. So, if you want to see, if you want to do that, so you go to here and then you type, you type Dix Utility. When you type that, it's gonna pop out, and then you go to this Utility. And then you're gonna see all my hard drive connected to my Mac. So I go to the first one. That's my part, that's my hard drive. I want to partition it. So you go to partition. If you already have data on it, which is not you know too much data for like like one gig, two gig, you can format it. So if you format it, like you erase everything. That means you're gonna lose all your previous data you have. On your external hard drive but me I don't want to lose anything even one megabyte even one byte I don't want to lose from my data so this is what I did I went to partition when you go to partition let's say this is the part I want to partition to be able to use it with Mac and Windows so if I take just this part and I come here I select it then I add the partition. If you click on add, you click on add, you're gonna see it divided into two. So that two means this is the first one, and then this is the second one. If you shoot the second one, so you come here, and then you change the extension to MS those fat. So which means your hard drive can be read by Mac and by Windows so you don't have any problem so this is the only thing you have to do so when you do that you divide it into like two equal parts 400 gigahertz 500 gigahertz and 500 gigahertz and you apply when you click apply it's gonna divide your hard drive into two and then the first one will only be used by mac and then the second partition will be used, can be used with your Mac or your window. This is how it works. And you see now I'm downloading. And after downloading is done, you see what's gonna happen. 